In this video, we're going to look at negative numbers involved in temperature type questions. So here I've made a really, I've spent ages making this thermometer. Okay, where you've got zero, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and zero, and then minus one, minus two, minus three, minus four, minus five, minus six, minus seven. So that's like a thermometer, and we're going to use that during the questions to help us out. Okay, so let's go straight into some questions. So here we've got a table that shows the midday temperature of five cities on a Sunday in January. So you've got Copenhagen, Geneva, London, Moscow, and Paris. And the temperatures are negative two, minus two, whatever, zero, three degrees, minus four, and minus one. It says which city was the warmest. Well, if you were to look at these temperatures, minus 2, 0, 3, well, 3 is quite high, minus 4, and minus 1. So, therefore, London has the highest temperature, so it's 3. Now, London, just be aware that it says which city is the warmest, okay? So, it doesn't say what's the highest temperature. It says what city is the warmest. So, you need to make sure you sort of look out for that. There is, sometimes they do try and trip you up by saying what is the warmest temperature, what was the highest temperature, okay? So, it says which city was the warmest. Question B, which city was the coldest? So, the coldest temperature was minus 4, and that was Moscow. So, the answer is Moscow. Okay, let's have a look at another question. Okay, this time it says, at 7 p.m., the temperature was 3 degrees Celsius, so 3 degrees Celsius. At midnight, the temperature had fallen by 5 degrees Celsius. What was the temperature at midnight? So we're going to go down 5 from 3, okay, because the temperature is 3 degrees Celsius, and it's going to fall by 5. So let's go down 5. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So the answer would be minus 2. So minus 2 degrees Celsius. Okay, um, always make sure you're counting zero. Okay, some people say, should you go one, two, and then jump? You you definitely count zero. Okay, so it's three degrees, and we were to decrease it by five. So one, two, three, four, five. So minus two degrees. So let's have a look at another question. It says at two a.m. the temperature was minus four, so minus four. It says by midday the temperature has risen, arisen 10 degrees Celsius. What was the temperature at midday? So we're going to go 10 up from minus 4. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So the answer would be 6 degrees Celsius. Now, if you're not very confident with your negative numbers, there's no reason why you can't draw a number line or a thermometer or something like that in the exam to help you. It's really up to yourself, anything to make sure you get the question right. As you do lots of them, you will become really easy to you, okay? So, because some people would just say, well, minus 4 plus 10 is 6, and just know that straight away. Okay, and finally, uh, the temperature at midday was recorded at a weather station in Scotland during a week in February. Five of the temperatures are shown in the table below. So, we've got Monday, Tuesday, if we don't have Wednesday. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and we don't have Sunday. It says, which of these five temperatures was the warmest? Notice it says, which of these five temperatures was the warmest? It doesn't say on which day was the warmest temperature. And it's giving you a clue. It's giving you the degree C here. So we just need to look at these numbers and see which one's got the highest temperature and put the answer in here, okay? So we've got minus 8. It's very cold. Minus 4, quite cold. Minus 1, cold. Minus 4 quite reasonably cold, and 2, which is the highest one. So 2 degrees Celsius was the warmest. Make sure you don't write down Monday. It didn't say which day was the highest temperature. It says which of these five temperatures was the warmest. On Wednesday, so Wednesday, the temperature at midday or midnight was 3 degrees lower than on Tuesday. So it's 3 degrees lower than on Tuesday. So it's 3 degrees lower than minus 4. So if we put minus 4, it says we're going to go 3 lower. So 3 down. So that's going to be 1 two, three, so minus seven. Okay. It says the temperature on Sunday was five degrees higher than on Saturday. So it's five degrees higher than on Saturday. So Saturday is at minus eight. Okay. And it says we're going to go five degrees higher, so five degrees up. So that's going to be one, two, three, four, five, which is minus three. Okay. And one more question. Finally, the last question is, what is the difference in temperature uh, between Monday and Tuesday? So Monday was 2, so 2, I'm just going to put a little 2 here, and Tuesday was minus 4. So what's the the difference in temperature? So Monday was 2, so let's count down, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 degrees. Now, give your answer as just the positive value, okay, so 6 degrees, okay? It says, what's the difference? So the difference is 6 degrees. 
don't worry about writing minus 6 so it going up or down. Use the 6 between it. The difference is 6. Okay, so the answer is 6 degrees.